June 14th. Um, I was sleeping in my clothes. <laughs> I was supposed to stay up. I was supposed to stay up to do work. But I think it was just a long day. I ended the day with the training and it was a longer training for Project Survive. I was grateful for it. It was just a longer training. And then my stomach started hurting. Anyways. One of my work goes on. <laughs> um, but the dream that I had. There were so many people. And so many different lives. And these were people I hadn't thought about. And these are... I was like, what is happening? I remember thinking that in my dream. I'm like, why, why am I seeing all of these individuals? Different. It was different sides of these individuals that I had not seen. That's what. That was the theme. Was that I was seeing all of the. So so remember that. Remember, remember there was one dreams, where it was one particular person, and it was like the, this extreme side of them. It was something like that, only smaller packaged. Um, but it was an extreme, but only the difference in that was that the emotional, um, it, it wasn't as strong. And I think it's because there were so many people. <laughs> and, and these people weren't as, they're not a big, they're not a part of my life. That's the thing, like they're not. And or no longer, they don't hold a big chunk of my time and energy. And and it's just different people from different parts of my life. And it was just like, uh, like just snippets, snippets, snippets of interaction. But, but what I'm being shown is an, an extreme side of them that I'm like, whoa, why am I seeing that from you? Right. And, and whoa, I've never seen this side of you before. So it's like I'm, I'm being shown different sides of people. And it's not just one people. It's just a lot of different people. I was like, why am I seeing this? It was, it was weird. It was weird. And it felt, it felt like there was just a lot, like I woke up exhausted. I woke up exhausted. Like there was just a lot for me to process but anyways I just like I can't get that dream oh I'm so tired still I don't know if it was just that dream but like yeah just like my old boss she wasn't even my direct boss but I saw an extreme side where I was like oh wow, wow. why am I being shown this side Mr. Bumble was there and, and I, I was seen, I was shown a side of him and I was like wondering if, if that's something that he struggles with. Um, that, yeah, there were other people that I was being shown side. I was like, what? But those two were the ones that stand out the most was my old boss and um, uh, Mr. Bumble. Those were the two that's, that stand out the most. It's wild. I don't know what that means. But, hey, it's recording. I got work to do. That's all. Show it to me. Hi. My name is Yubi, and in case you haven't figured it out, this footage is capturing my experience as I learn to navigate my personal spiritual awakening. Um, I am learning that this experience is unique to each one of us. Um, in whatever way we believe we are embracing living our truth, this just happens to be my journey. Um, and despite me having a graduate degree and a license in clinical social work, this by no means is intended to replace any type of mental health advice. This is just me on a personal level, uh, documenting my experience, shedding light on the truth that I am learning and discovering for myself, um, and really inviting you along for the ride. Um, if by some <laughs> magical chance 
you find this content to be helpful in any way, shape, or form, please click the like button, you know, share the message, subscribe to my YouTube channel. I have an Instagram account, a personal one, and one specifically for this channel that you're more than welcome to check out. Um, I'm an open book. Um, I have also created t-shirt t-shirt designs. I'm wearing my favorite one right now, which is the North Node um, uh, design, um, but I have that and other things uh, that you can look at um, inspired by this process and journey. Um, and I have the link in the description box as well as in the about section of my YouTube um, channel. So you're more than welcome to check those items out. Um, any type of support is you know, right? <laughs> um, again, if, if you find this content really helpful or meaningful, sometimes when we um, take that step and, and, and be vulnerable, you know, with, with showing what's inside our hearts and what's really our truth, we realize that we're much more connected um, than, than what we thought we were. And so um, I hope that um, as I'm living this experience it, and that you find some type of truth for yourself or, or find some type of um, ability to heal in some way just by relating, you know, just just by knowing that you're not alone. That really has been my goal with, with this process, um, not just um, being able to connect with others, but really for my own healing. Um, it's definitely been a therapeutic experience and a very creative one for, for myself. So I thank you and um, I wish you all the best and you know, we'll see what else um, comes next for me.